We have an update now to breaking news. We brought you at the top of the newscast. Again, a fire had broken out at the uh, Hulley Corporation, the refinery, and the west side of Tulsa. Right now, uh, 2 News reporter Jason Grubbs is live on the scene with some new information from fire officials. Yeah, in fact, Karen and Russ, the fire officials are joining me right now. Just tell me kind of what you guys know. Jason, what we got going on right now, we got a tanker that's on fire. Uh, we got the Holler Refinery firefighters inside uh, actually trying to put this blaze out. Our guys, Tulsa Fire Department guys, are just on standby right now. We have an engine truck inside and our assistant chief, and we got it surrounded by some of our fire personnel. And we're just waiting for them to tell us to, yes, come in, help us, or no, we got it under control. Do you have a cause on this yet? Not as of yet. Uh, anybody hurt? It doesn't appear that anyone is hurt right now. All we know is their tanker's on fire. They haven't really given us a lot of information because, as you can see, they're, they're really busy right now. All right, thank you very much, Tim okay. Smallwood, with the uh, Tulsa Fire Department out here handling things, keeping us surprised of what's going on right now. Uh, again, the fire back there, I'm going to step out of the way so you can actually see the pictures there. Uh, those are live images of a tank that is inside the refinery on the West Bank that we all grew up around and know very well. We're actually in the parking lot of the Holly Refinery Company right now. I believe that is uh, what the company is inside there. Again, nobody hurt. Uh, Tulsa fire officials on standby with the crews that actually work with the refinery company in there handling everything. Uh, we will be out here to monitor the situation. They uh, do not have any other tanks uh, that I'm aware of that are on fire. Karen had asked that earlier. Uh, we believe it is just that one in there. Firefighters are putting water on that tank and the surrounding tanks to make sure nothing else blows up. So uh, we'll be out here monitoring the situation. Russ and Karen, back to you.